What may look like a house to you is something much more magnificent to the boy inside. What did you think when you saw this place for the first time? We said it's second heaven. Second heaven? Yes. You pass through this before you go to the big heaven. That is what I believe so. He means that literally. And why wouldn't he? Abraham and his brother James are from Sierra Leone. They were homeless before finding their way to an orphanage and eventually to their new family outside Charlotte, North Carolina. Oh. Joe and Jamie Walker adopted them last fall, and they say the boys have been wide-eyed with wonder ever since. It's fun. Every little thing that we take for granted, coming home from the airport and I hit the button to open our front gate, Dad! Everything is magic to them. It's magic. <laughs> Whether it's a present just yes. showing up on Christmas morning yes. or something mundane, like a car wash. The kids are constantly blown away. But the biggest surprise, the most profound reaction happened last month on Abraham's 12th birthday. You had birthdays before you came here. How did you celebrate them? That would be a crazy question. Why is that a crazy question? I never celebrate them. I never knew it was my birthday. Happy birthday. So when the song started and his mom appeared with that glowing tribute, Abraham was overwhelmed. When I see the cake, I thought that is the most beautiful thing I've ever seen. The birthday cake. It's not just a birthday cake. It's a blessing cake. A blessing cake. And what a blessing it is. <laughs> that once a year, friends and family gather just to honor our existence. Most of us take that for granted, but not in this house, not anymore. Just being reminded that we need to stop and be super grateful for what we do have. A good wish for America from this American dream come true. Steve Hartman, On the Road, in Charlotte.